Welcome to 1407 Gray Malkin Lane. This is the living memory of the X-Men. Don't let anyone tell you different. All right. So Judgment Day number three. Um okay, you know what? Honestly, I'm kind of checking out. I don't care. Like this is just an attempt. To put the Eternals over, make them seem like they're a big time deal. And who do you go have them go up against? The X Men. We've seen this. Marvel does this a lot, and I, I I'm kind of over it. Like the art is great. Kill it. Kieran Gilliam is doing his thing. I, I probably know I got his name wrong, but. <sighs> If this is just another event, and I, I, you know, and this is just a way to make the Eternals seem interesting in this post, uh, everything gets a uh, you know what, Disney, let's call it, it is. it's Disney. <sighs> um, a lot of cool stuff happens in this book, I'm all for it. It's just, I don't care, I don't care about Judgment Day. Uh, this would mean I have to care about the Eternals, and no, no, I'm just, I'll do the tie-ins, but I think this may be my last of the Judgment Day. <sighs> I'm giving this book a, t um, a quarter of a star out of five stars. Like everything is great. I just there's no there's nothing. I'm not excited about it. So, this is 1407 Great Monkey Lane, signing out.